Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and some terrain for um, a little bit of a change of pace here. So we picked up a whole bunch of extra goodies at Adepticon uh, and from our uh, good friends, uh, Miniature Building Authority, just because A, they make some of the best stuff out there and we wanted to pick up some more um, scatter terrain and things like that for a couple different games that we play. But uh, in particular, uh, saw some of the newer things that they had here um, for their uh, what's called Mesoamerican line and figured that would fit right in with some of the stuff that we have for one of our tables for Blood and Plunder. So we wanted to show you guys and feature them on the channel a little bit. Uh, we'll put a link in the uh, pinned comment below. But we're going to get this all out of the bags here, show you guys what you can expect when you pick up some of their terrain and just some of the crazy details detail as well. We'll be right back. Alrighty guys, we're back and we got everything opened up here for you. So just a quick glance at the train. So uh, nice thing here, there's no assembly uh, on something like this. So basically you get it right out of the box. Uh, it is resin, so you're going to take the usual steps in working with resin, but super cool and just something that's different that, you know, you really can't get this with like um, MDF kits or anything like that, uh, which, you know, has become such a staple of terrain but just uh, to add some cool uh unique features here to like a, a jungle theme board for things like blood and plunder and other um, games that would be set um in um in the new world here uh this is just good stuff um so just some area terrain some scatter terrain whatever you want to call it but super detailed here again miniature building authority does great stuff so we'll see if we can capture some of that for you there Detailed without being um, overly overly busy, as you might see in some other uh, companies, things like that. So this takes up a fair bit of space. You can kind of see that relative to my hand. Um, so a little bit of cover, things like that. Then we got this piece here. So just a giant head embedded in a stone. Yeah, I think these are all supposed to be kind of like Olmecs or something like that. But... These have some weight to them as well, so they're not going to slide around on the tabletop as well. And then this piece is really cool. Um, ridiculous on the detail. Um, so we have to research some designs just to see how something like that would have looked actually in color. But that is just bonkers level detail that they've actually got all those little fine details in this. But... Super cool. This will look, all the stuff will look great and like can just pop on the tabletop for this type of board. So, again, simple affair. Just got to get it all washed up and cleaned up, ready for paint. But yeah, so a couple of kits. I think they have a few more in the range. We didn't um, ultimately pick up everything uh, at Adepticon, but just a, 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 little, a little smattering here of um, some of these new. Um, uh, American uh, jungle, uh, so New World uh, kits here, so Old Max, etc. Um, for for terrain for miniature building authority. So just overall, really good stuff. This um, not too not too much to pick up all these. Although um, if there is ever a gripe with miniature building authority, it's because they're fairly pricey. But on the other hand, you get really great stuff. So um, you know, if you want cheaper terrain, there's other options out there for you. You can certainly go the 3D printing route, MDF, whatever else, or scratch build your own stuff if you're looking to go that route. But um, as far as some, getting something like this, um, yeah, just right out of the box, ready to paint, essentially. Um, you can't go wrong. So Miniature Building Authority, uh, really good stuff here. So check them out, guys. We'll put a link in the uh, pinned comment for the video, and we'll have plenty more of their terrain here in um, future videos. We did pick up a whole bunch of other kits for various other projects we're working on. But if you're looking for something cool for like your blood and plunder tables, um, or again, things set in the, the New World, um, Central America, and so on. This is a great way to go. So let us know, guys, if you've used Miniature Building Authority for any of your gaming uh, terrain needs, uh, how you like them overall. Uh, hit us up in the comments there. Uh, be sure to like and subscribe as well, and we'll have more terrain videos for you coming real soon. Thanks for watching.